<laughs> we have a beautiful trend of weather so mild for us 64 degrees right now winds are out of the southwest we have this weak front coming through southwest winds ahead of it it comes through dry but what it will do is set up a northwesterly wind and what that will do eventually is turn the winds off the lake so 79 today one more mild day on monday but then tuesday we start watching for that storm threat to arrive and model data keeps slowing down the system so it it looks like it's going to be late in the day and into the night. That's why the Wednesday rain chance has come up to 70% because it looks like some of that active weather may be around through the night. So here is the update now from the Storm Prediction Center for Tuesday through the night. We are at a level two as far as severe weather goes on a scale of one to five. It is higher to the west of us where there is a level three there from Quincy westward. So we will watch these storms take shape. Now on Futurecast, we're seeing that throughout the course of the day, showers and thunderstorms could amplify heading into the evening rush. But it's this main line that we're going to be watching as it rolls through after dark perhaps and is right overhead. This is at three in the morning. You start seeing those intense cells moving through the western suburbs first and then pushing through the city as well. So we're going to keep a close eye on this storm track. But what we expect, waves of storms, especially into the night. This is Tuesday night, very early Wednesday morning, where we do have that damaging wind threat. So you want to keep checking in with us here, even though it's so dry and quiet today and tomorrow. Each model run will give us a better handle on the timing of this system. So for now, we have Tuesday as an as a weather alert day just because of the storm prediction center putting us at a level two but we may have to include wednesday as well if this slows down even more this leaves us with a cool change coming up for next weekend